Hello, welcome back to another modification review. Today, we're going to look at a modification that adds in a little bit more to one of my favorite units in all of Warhammer, a Warrior Priest. I played one in Warhammer Online, and I love them, even to this day. And I really want to see a lot more love for them, so I'm looking for modifications that do add more for them, too. Now, we have what's called a Battle Brother, and then over here, we should have what is called a Venerated Battle Brother. And in the very front, we've got our cultists, too. They would like to follow the God Emperor, Sigmar. We're heading into battle. They've got a lot of soldiers here that are very powerful. Even the Everwatcher, who I'll have linked down below too as a mod addition. Oh boy, that should not be easy. I wonder if someone made a mod to make a Lord, a Warrior Priest. I mean, I would like that a lot. I feel like that would be doable. All right, we're about to launch in battle. I don't know if we can win. We're outnumbered, but I'm hoping that my holy men here can do a great job and win the battle. Oh, good thing I began to run. Holy hell. Magic in the very beginning. Not good. Okay, Carl, come on. Time for a crazy charge. It will not be easy. Here we go. And here they come. We're heavily outnumbered, but I feel like they might be able to pull it off. And I like how they're glowing. <laughs> That's how you know they're holy. Oh, here they come now. Chosen of Nurgle. One dead already. Oh wait, nope, he's back up, Never mind. I was only kidding. Okay, let's use a bit of that right now. Make sure that we're doing what we need to do. Use what you have right now, Warrior Priest. I mean, you're only one hero. But I do feel like today should be a lot more powerful. You know, the actual hero. But having a unit is not too bad either. Yeah, a cultist will really not get very far. They're not meant to be that powerful. They do have poison though. But they're getting torn down right now. All right, let's go check out the battle while they're all fighting. Here's Carl fighting. Here they go. But yeah, I led a order guild over in Warhammer Online as a warrior priest, and it was really quite a bit of fun. Amusingly enough, Order, which was the faction that we were on, the dwarves, the elves, and all of that, we were quite organized in chaos while well, they had a lot of infighting and drama in their community. <laughs> it was very appropriate. I remember we were in a temple in Altdorf and we had a inter-guild meeting. It was like over 20 guilds total all in one location. Well, with their leaders and I hosted the meeting and I remember we would bring up topics to talk about and my character would point at whoever would like to speak. We would raise their hand or salute or whatever they could do via a emote and we would talk things out in a role play type way and it was really quite a bit of fun man we are in there I don't know if we're gonna win though we haven't killed a lot of them yet we're dropping now my venerated battle brothers are doing a much better job if I can get Carl to come over here and take out oh here we go yeah he's here hey buddy how's it going Okay, I'm gonna buff up in every way. Because we need to defeat the Everwatcher. Fortunately, he just did a lot of damage. Come on, Everwatcher, get out. And the battle goes on right now. Being knocked down. Here they come, though. They're gonna to encircle my men. The priests are having a pretty tough time trying to hold up. We can get that Everwatcher down forever. A lot like that, yeah. Then we'll have a much easier shot. Oh, you're gone. Oh, your butt, you're back. How very Zinch like. A bug? I think not. No, that was called Zinch magic. <laughs> Here we go now. Yeah, Carl on Deathclaw is incredibly powerful. I think I might show off Valton if all of you would like to see that. Valton is essentially seen as the physical reincarnation of Sigmar. Whether that is true or not, no one really knows, but Carl Franz is so impressed by him that he gave him Galt Moraz to use in battle. So maybe, I don't know. We need to get you out of there. You don't need to be all over there by yourself. That would be a terrible idea for you to keep that up. The battle Brothers are fighting pretty hard, though. Oh no, they're dying. My poor little men. They are falling apart. All right, there we are. We're still fighting everywhere. Heavily outnumbered. 
Now, my venerated battle brothers are fighting together though. And I feel like they're gonna have a much easier time winning because of that. Battle craters. Alright, you got that going on. Oh, you have no benefits really. But you do. They're not showing up. It's kinda strange. It means psychology. Sigmar's Fury. Encourage. Yeah. Pretty good. What about you, buddy? Oh, you're using two Warhammers. I don't remember you doing that. Is that like a change? I hope it is, because I mean, I would rather them use two hammers than hold a book the entire time. I mean, I get it, but no. <laughs> Use another weapon or a shield, whatever you need to. Yeah, Carl's pulling it off. He's breaking them. Though we have many more to fight. Look over here, we do. Soul fire now. Will it do a lot of damage? I don't know. How many has it killed? Nine, only nine. Okay, Carl's here. He's taking a lot of damage though. Okay, all of you, you're all over here. You need to come help out the Emperor. I mean, that is what you're here for, to help him out. I'm very shocked about how well they're doing. I mean, we are fighting a lot of armored soldiers. who are very well armored. I mean, we might lose a few battle brothers here and there, but they're gonna pull it off. I know they will. Here they come. There we go. One thing I do hope they add in over time is a lot more animations. I mean, we do need a lot more animations for the battle as a whole. Killing animations for sure. I mean, Medieval 2 had quite a few and they were very fun to watch. Knocking them on the ground, stabbing them on the ground, you know, things that are fun to watch in a video game. Yeah, they're doing it. Oh, don't tell me you're dead. All right, good, get back up. Yeah, they're fighting back. Are any of you not fighting? A few of you are not fighting, surprisingly. They're beating them back. We're not fully done yet, but we're beating them back. They only need to charge in again. Yeah, buff them up. I wonder if you were buffed up by the mod. I'm not actually sure. I don't believe you were. You're just kind of doing well because you've got allies here doing well. All right, let's go check out over here now. Where again, they're outnumbered and fighting. Now, when I pull out from over on my right flank and I come over here, we'll have a much easier time. They'll have reinforcements and I'll do a much better job, but they are knocking down a lot of them. Yeah, they're not gonna break. They're zealous to their god. They're not gonna break. Now, Chaos, yeah, they're gonna break. That's gonna happen. That's a reality. Yeah, they're very, look, I mean, these guys are very strong. They're not taking any damage, really. Look at that armor and leadership. Very high melee defense, which I think is a little bit more logical if they don't have a lot of armor. Oh, look at that change in armor. 35 for a battle brother. If you're venerated, over 100. Man. I mean, they are well armored. And bald. It's like an army of Vin Diesels here. All right. I'm going to take, I think, two of you to come over here to help out. Yeah. Actually, you too. Come on. Carl, you'll be over here helping out. Okay, Battle Brothers, I want two more of you to move over here. Let the venerated ones go do their job, but the remainder of you need to come over here to help out big time. They need a lot of help. They're being surrounded and they might even lose if they're fighting alone. We can't have that. We can't allow that. Okay, you'll come over here and fight. You'll wait over here and if they come at me, well, I'll get them. Here they come. Whether or not I'll use them in a campaign, I'm not too sure yet. I don't like adding in too many mods into a pre-existing campaign. It could really change things up and not always in a positive way. Not to mention, you can't really take out a unit mod whenever you have one added in. That is why I'm very careful about them. A balance change? Okay, that's one thing. But a unit mod, if you take them out, the game will crash. And we're doing a long-running campaign. You can't allow that. All right, Carl has it. He's doing all right. Come over here. You guys are over here now. They're not breaking fully yet. But yeah, they did it. They had a big fight. Gotta add in more of them. Probably could have fought in an even bigger fight. Oh, they do have a shield. It's cool. You guys are shielded. Are you all shielded? You are, okay. They're not wanting to break for all the time. Do you guys even take damage? Are they even taking damage? <laughs> They are incredibly tanky. 
It's gonna be the high armor, not to mention they're doing magical damage every time they hit. Which I'm sure is quite beneficial. Okay, come over here and fight. Charge in now, right over here. You'll come over here and fight them. They're doing it. By Sigma. They do it. They're bashing them down. Yeah, I've got a Chaos Mod right now. I need to feature it at some point. What do all of you think? Should I feature it? I probably should. If you have any type of battle format that you would like to see, like any type of unique battle, let me know and I can make it happen. I can make it a reality. You guys are... You're still around. One guy, he's like, yeah, I'll do it. Or Shigmar and whatnot. Oh, he's only got a little hammer. Tragic. Can they do it? Will he be able to do it? Let's find out. Nope. He's dead. Okay, can you do it? Come on. I don't believe in you, but you now have help. He's not dead, is he? Nope. There's a lot of armor. Okay. Buff them all up. They're all buffed up now. There's more of you over here. You guys are still fighting and taking like no damage at all, which again is blowing my mind. So they might be a little bit too powerful then if they're not taking any damage at all. I mean, the Battle Brothers feel a little bit more balanced out. I mean, they're not even getting a lot of kills for their numbers, but we have won the battle now. That was a crazy fight. I didn't think they would win at all. Again, I haven't played with a unit like that before, and I had no idea they would win. All right. Pirate victory. They killed enough to win. Okay, thank you for watching. Check out the mod down below, and as always, until then.